Well, of course, from treats to toys, you can spoil your furry friend with a one-of-a-kind shopping experience. Are you one of those? You're a pet owner, right? Of course I am. I have a little 13-pound bowling ball named Savvy. <laughs> This is marketed to her then if she's talking oh, like that about her dog. Oh so yes, we have a Shih Tzu named Max, and yes, my <laughs> wife does put a little sweater on it sometimes. It's like, don't do that. Come on. When it's yeah, really yeah. cold, you want them to be comfortable. Anyway, the Pooch House is a logo pet boutique that will come straight to you, to right to you. Our executive producer Katie Fellows caught up with them to see what's going on and what it's all about. A few years back, I had a little Yorkie. And I used to uh, make clothes for her. I went and learned how to sew, and I'd make clothes for her. And several people, they uh, would mention, you know, if you sold those, I'd buy them. So I started making a few things, doing local craft shows, that kind of thing. And it just got bigger and bigger. And we bought this truck, and <laughs> here wow. we are rolling. We've been doing it for about a year now. For a year. Mm -hmm. So you make everything that's in here, or most things? I make, oh. I would say about 50% of the okay. but the clothing is almost entirely handmade. Mm -hmm. And um, the accessories, we've got collar flowers, bow ties, scarves, hats, that's all handmade. And I do carry retail, toys, collars, harnesses, leashes. What goes into making something? Do you, are you inspired by something you see? Do you find a cool fabric, events? Yeah, usually it's fabric. Mm -hmm. I go to the store and I check out what's new, what's hot. I see what women are wearing, what men are wearing, that kind of, I try to bring it over into the doggy world. Where can people find you around town, your mobile pet boutiques? You can really go anywhere. I can, and I do, I try to. Um, let's see, you can find me at local artisan markets. We do a lot of the local pet events here in town, adoption events. What about if I'm having a birthday party for my dog or something in my home, would you even do those Absolutely, kind of we can do private parties and I'll even offer the hostess um, you know, whether you'd like some store credit or something special for your pup, so absolutely. This is Riley, he's our truck dog. Um, whenever you walk on the truck, you'll meet him. He's always gonna be the first one you meet, too. Oh, and he's so sweet and friendly. You. And you encourage the pets to come on, I too? do, absolutely. We allow all kinds of pets. We're no breed restrictions. And I want the pets on here. I want them to try on our clothes. Oh, yeah, and um, my dog, I have a very large dog. Mm -hmm. He's about 70 pounds. Mm -hmm. So um, would you make clothes for a dog of that size? Yes, we uh, carry in stock sizes from extra, extra small to 5X, but anything can be customized. We just okay. need some measurements. What advice do you have for maybe some of the people at home watching um, just in starting their own business or making what they are passionate about their job? I would say stick with it, absolutely. So many times I wanted to kick it in and just say no more, but I stuck with it, I stuck with it, and I, I have so much fun. That's that's really what it's about, it's just going out, having fun. I love meeting the people, I love meeting their pets. It's just fun, yeah. you know? We all have something in common, we all love our pets. They're all family. 